McConaughey. A downtown L.A. hotel at the center of controversy, the L.A. Grand, is part of Mayor Bass's Inside Safe program aimed at getting the homeless into transitional housing. Guests are treated to housekeeping and even meals. But workers say those same guests they're trying to help are destroying the hotel. KCAL's Amanda Starantino has the story. This is what it looks like inside the L.A. Grand Hotel in downtown Los Angeles. The hotel staff is outside City Hall on the picket lines this week, saying they are fed up with what they are dealing with in their workplace. Even the smell of the rooms is so bad. Like, you just want to breathe there, clean air, but you can. Maribel Ferjado has been a housekeeper at the hotel for almost 25 years, but in the last three, her job has been cleaning up messes like this. They have a bunch of, like, trash, food all over the place. They have animals. The city's Inside Safe program takes the homeless off the streets and into safe hotel rooms. The LA Grand has been providing shelter space since May of 2020, first with the county's project room key, which expired and transitioned into the city's Inside Safe. You could get rape. You could get any disease or you could anything, but we're trying our best to stay there, to work hard, to be there, but nobody wants to help us. These workers are asking for better security and also just more staffing so they can better serve all the different types of guests they have staying at the hotel. A statement from Russell Cox, who represents the hotel's owner, says in part, the city provides a robust security presence and has on staff trained social service providers to deal with individuals who display any type of unacceptable behavior. Cox says hotel workers have panic buttons, security monitoring, and staff is instructed to contact their supervisor if a room's condition is abnormal. Since the LA Grand has been providing this shelter space, Cox says there has never been any physical assault on any of their staff. In a statement from the mayor's office, it says the Grand House is hundreds of the most vulnerable Angelinos and our office will continue to do all we can to save lives and ensure workers are safe and treated fairly. The city has a lease with the LA Grand until the end of July. However, there are plans to begin to move residents of the Inside Safe program to another hotel starting in May. We're not used to it with, like working with the homeless. I just signed up to be a housekeeper cleaner and that's it. In Los Angeles, Amanda Starantino, KCAL News. More news to come tonight, including a popular wedding venue suddenly closed.